Ladies and gentlemen, it is so fantastic to see you. Hopefully you've been enjoying your day. Uh, we're, we're, gonna, we're here in that time. <laughs> uh, feels weird, but we're here. Also, we're rocking a medieval night woman, rocking a kamas that is brighter than, than the sun. So, love it. <laughs> weird as shit, love it. Oh, it's not good coffee. It's, not, it's never good coffee. It's always black as shit. It's not white. It's not white. It's just bitter. It's not good. <laughs> but, ladies and gentlemen, I thought... Um, that I would have it built, but unfortunately, shit takes a long time to build. Second thing is I thought I had more materials than I did, and I overestimated myself, but I still wanted to make the video of us actually showcasing the tennis ball launcher. Now, it is my hope that we'll be able to level it up to the maximum point, but it's looking pretty grim. In fact, at this point, I might just say, screw it, is there stuff here? It's rare that they sell purple metal. Does it require more than just that? <laughs> I think it requires more than just that. Okay, good. Okay, no. All right, we're good. Okay, I was I was freaking out. <laughs> we're okay. Um, I could buy this and be over the hump, but it's just it's twelve thousand fucking metal. Or you know what I mean? Shit. None of my none of my boys, none of my, my boys and girls in the bridge have anything. <laughs> Please. <laughs> I mean, I don't use my death metals for shit, so I, 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 but it's potential storage, you know? And I'm a filthy uh, hoarder, so yes. Not anybody has one. I just need one. And then it just starts asking for special steel. You rat. I know. I know I need special steel for my mace. Although my mace is pretty leveled up already. I know some of you are like, Green, I have the mace maxed out. And I'm like, I don't know why I did that to your neck. Uh, yeah, you should probably get that looked at, but uh, good, good for you. Oh, also, I need that. Hey, hey, you. Put that in the thing. No, so I have to grind that shit. I hate that. It's the worst. <laughs> Gotta grind that stupid resort. Come on, my last person. That's it. Okay, well. Fuck it. <laughs> I don't want to climb the tower for six years to try to get one medal. <laughs> okay? Wait, wait. There's No, there's not really much hope because I'm not that high in the TDM. But maybe still something. <laughs> we got iron. We got some money to throw around. We got a login bonus. Look at us. I don't have any room. <sighs> well, ladies and gentlemen, today is a sad day, but we will bring this motherfucker to the final form, to its to its final form. It, I got it. The last upgrade doesn't ask for two, right? Because <laughs> that's where I'm like, oh, this is entirely pointless. <laughs> no, it only asks for a one. God. <laughs> I don't even play this game much anymore. But my past self is like, you fucking tra- <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just- Oh. No. Well. It's what it is. How's progress going on the armor grin? I it's happening. Slowly but surely. I really don't want to- Bullet metal I think is going to be chill. It, maybe not. Maybe it asks for it at its end tier. But th but this fucking, the pants. The pants are starting to peeve me off. Look at this bone metal. Four per per, per upgrade. Uh, actually, no, that, that we're done. Okay, no, we're chill. It's good. Look at us. <laughs> look at us go. And then the helmet. Don't, don't look at me. A lot of you guys were like, yeah, Grin, it's the fucking most thing. Like, it's the craziest upgrade path in the game, you idiot. And I'm like, I know. I don't want to do it. Good news. I might have enough scratch. I might have no scratch level up all the way. Hopefully it doesn't ask for more than two. Probably does. Regardless, uh, ladies and gentlemen, sorry, today in this video, pain and suffering aside of me losing my mass of resources, um, we are going to test out, well, we're going to have to take uh, take a deposit out first. <laughs> all right. Over here. I don't know how much it's going to be. Let's just take out uh, a few hundred. I, th I think it may be enough. Uh, probably not. No, it's not even plus four. Yeah, we should be fine. Maybe. It's six hours. This is a lot. I'm not going to be here in six hours, dog. I'm going to be working out. <laughs> Leave me alone. All right. Where are we going? Baseball pitcher tier three and bring it to plus five will only increase its magazine. So we should be able to test the waters pretty good here. Um, I do have the tennis ball launcher that that is not fully level. Oh, actually, it was pretty cheap. I didn't need to take out a fucking monstrous loan. Actually, it was pretty chill, huh? Look at that. <laughs> Look at that. Anyways, storage. So, a while back, y'all, back in the heyday of Let It Die when we were all really into it and uh, everyone was too kind, honestly, like a little, like, what's your ulterior motive, huh? <laughs> why, why are you so kind? What's happening? <laughs> Anyways, uh, you guys sent me some of these, the pitchers at their final tier. Now, yes, mine is plus four, but um, it, again, unless this is different, I do think the TDM things follow its proper path, uh, which is 
Well, should I equip my striker? I mean, if I can get something done with my my really shitty collector. Yeah, it's fine. This it, it does good damage. If you guys don't believe me, then well, <laughs> I Jesus, I thought I earned I thought I earned more than that, <laughs> but I guess. Actually, let's switch this around. I want this to be here. This to be here. All right. Uh, so yes. Look at us go. We look like a freak, but the best kind of freak. Look at our armor in conjunction with everything else. The weirdness of these cartoony tennis ball machines. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Which do like an ins excessive amount of damage. Um, but anyways, uh, so this is it at a base. It does 1,410 damage. It's also all into weirdly blunt, even though it's technically like a firing gun. Does it? Does it? Let me see. <laughs> I might be crazy, but does this Wikipedia page tell you how this son of a bitch scales? Oh my god What the fuck are you shitting me? That's insane when it becomes uncapped it gets one one thousand one hundred and fourteen bullets. I Just once I gotta check <laughs> We're a little scattered. All right. <laughs> it's been a while since we've been let die um <laughs> Yeah, that's way more. Oh no, it's about the same. <laughs> it's about the same. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. Oh my god, it's five thousand. Jesus Christ. But yeah, no, that's. that's I did not expect it to have that much, much uh, ammunition. You're gonna be able to use that forever. <laughs> Jesus. Also, this is weirdly. I, I just don't know how this scales. If it scales off of strength, that's amazing. Flail in one hand with this, cartoony. It kind of ruins the aesthetic, but it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. I'm sure one of y'all will tell me, but if it if it's a magical weapon that scales off of strength and not like dexterity and shit, that'd be amazing. <laughs> I don't think it does. I only know one weapon that really is, was talked about that scales off of strength, and that's Medusa. And apparently she doesn't even scale off 100% uh, of that. She scales off of like half strength and half dexterity still, which is bullshit. Why can't we just have any range damage as a melee user? <laughs> Anyways. So yes, this has uh, 1,480 uh, uh, and 10 damage. Uh, this one has 1,709. I don't... Yes, this is leveled up to plus three, but I don't think the jump is like... Yeah, this has 10% more damage than, it, than its predecessor, which is typically how the TDM diamond ones work, uh, which is pretty legit. Anyways, uh, yes, it has 1,470 uh, durability. Pretty chill. As well as its guard power is C, which means you're not going to give you any defense. And of course, its rage move takes two um, to actually cast. That's pretty cheap, actually. Not the worst. But... Here's the thing. This is what makes the tennis ball launcher above, just besides the fact that it does a lot of base damage, um, and it's just good in general. Uh, this is what makes it nuts. Red Rush, uh, knock down enemies uh, for a set length of time. That's a bait. Oh, that's sorry. That's that's a that's a hidden diamond for sure. Knocks down enemies for a set length. Are you high? <laughs> what? <laughs> it's not what that does at all. <laughs> That's insane that it's listed like that. No, no, this thing supercharges its itself. Yeah, maybe it has knockback, but it also increases your fire rate by a boatload, um, as well as it just. Uh, it seems I think it gets a, it gets a tiny damage buff. I, regardless, I think the base thing is that it, it gets knockback, like it says, but also increases its fire rate by a whole lot. I could be crazy, but I thought that's how it worked. I thought it basically you don't need to charge it up; it just immediately fires at its highest uh, attack speed. Regardless, let's go see how this thing works on Cohen. What? No, we should. This is both five-star weapons, so we can't go too low. But let's let's go. Let's go 36. We'll fuck some shit up on 36, and then we'll go get Cohen. Now, I guess we're like, why are you going? Not Cohen. Got to every day. Never changes. Love you, God, <laughs> for making me this way, or whatever. Whatever. Maybe it's just chance, fate, the stardust, all that. <laughs> But we need to farm uh, Gato because we still need that red metal. We're still leveling up the armor whenever we play this game. That's what's happening. I don't like how the woman that I'm playing is like the most pale human that's ever existed. And her white skin is bleeding through the shadow mask. Is that, is that, is that not okay? <laughs> if it is, I apologize. <laughs> if it is not, then I don't know, dude. <laughs> I don't know what you want from me. I'm just a Canadian guy. What do you want from me? I'm just, I'm just over here. Living my best life trying to not fuck shit up. Anyways, here's the weak version. He's naked, so it's gonna do nothing. Oh, wow, you really hurt a lot more than I... We don't even hurt, it's just that I'm failing. Fire, goddamn you! There it is. 23,000 on a collector with nothing. Nothing, guys. I am rocking the most free-to-play <laughs> farm character you could ever see. The elevator, super dirt cheap, as well as I can run forever, because I'm a coward and I don't want to dive to all that shit. Also, we do need steel for leveling up the chest piece at its end tier. I think the pads as well. They become gluttons when it comes to steel. And the helmet becomes a glutton for uh, ultra-pure iron, which is 
defense. It doesn't even do steel. It does ultra pure iron. Like, get over yourself, helmet. <laughs> All right, you don't even buff yourself. It just looks cool, but it's, it's excessive <laughs> how much uh, how much it costs. Also, this person was naked. So this, per oh, this person is naked too. Oh, you're not naked. Oh, you're not naked. Okay, that makes sense. But see, as you fire this weapon, it will start to increase its fire rate. So when you activate its alt, it just immediately starts at that maximum fire rate. Uh, and it's just, it's really good because there's any weapon that you can get a shit ton of damage in. Um, there you go. So you're naked. Let's chill out. Okay, I thought I was far enough away. <laughs> I was not. Let's do this. Pop! 18 damage, but I think the previous one crit. Yeah, that's definitely what happened, I think. But regardless, any weapon that can deal a shit ton of damage in a small amount of time is amazing for forceman fights because you have such a small amount of time. Also, look at the range on this thing. Wait. There it is. <laughs> Pretty still good range, but a little bit finicky. And then I did 2,000 damage. Maybe it's when you kill something, it just, yeah, it doesn't show you, like, the rest of the damage numbers. Bop. Bop. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, that must be their base HP. Oh, also, I have this thing not leveled up at all. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, this thing's elemental mastery apparently increases uh, the amount of balls fired to your attack speed. Uh, which is actually huge. <laughs> That's the, the way the weapon works. It'll just time your damage in a big way. Um, but again, uh, the thing that makes this weapon crazy is the way it kind of synergizes with uh, you going to fight Forceman. So when you fight a Forceman, typically you'll eat a cat eye that damages you, um, but it'll give you a huge opening to deal a shit ton of damage, and the enemy doesn't really get to fight you, and they don't get a guard, uh, which most time Forceman don't do that, but still. Um, anyways, the other thing that you do, typically, with this with Forceman fights, is you eat an unlimited ammo shroom. So you eat an unlimited ammo shroom, and then you can just lay into this person full... Um, uh, with as much bullets as, you, bullets as you possibly can. So anything that gets affected by fire rate, so you don't ever take, like you just, it's about damage output, not about damage efficiency at that point. It's just, you're just trying to melt this thing as soon as you possibly can, with as much damage as you possibly can. And of course, that's best for this. Uh, not only that, but I do believe, um, maybe I can actually see here. Let me see. Um, the reason why I think it'd be good for Black Thunder is because... Where is it? Right here. Black Thunder has, uh, yeah, weakness to blunt, and this is exactly, this is all blunt damage, so. Pretty solid. Now, the only negative to this, um, is that when you do fire, like, you are slow for this huge amount of time. Like, and uh, fire and run, 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 can't. <laughs> you know what I mean? So you do, again, it's why the weapon is really, really optimal for, like, super long range, or a fight that you kind of shove a bunch of mushroom, mushrooms in your mouth to kind of negate everything around it. Uh, so yeah, uh, but we'll do the same thing in this god of fight. Uh, uh, maybe I should change, put some pants on, <laughs> some actual, well, <laughs> some pants on, because yes, uh, this fight, if I do get hit, could die, I already lost a lot of death medals <laughs> today, in a lazy endeavor to not want to grind for more up in the top floors, so is what it is, <laughs> but yes. Which is, it's kind of stupid. Yeah, because I could have just, like, I'm going to have to climb higher to the to Tengeku at some point to level up this armor, because I'm going to need that much steel and ultra pure iron that... It's just like I'm just putting it off, <laughs> but if I can put that off as long as I possibly can, I'll be happy. Actually, holy shit, that works really well. I, it was, wait, let me see. Yeah, sometimes I thought our little tiny little like dreads, <laughs> our butt dreads, <laughs> would uh, would leak through, but now we're good. Yeah, and I thought it would like clip really badly. It actually, no, it weirdly works. I mean, when you start moving, it starts clipping, but that's that's not that bad. And that really actually like looks pretty normal. Now I do think that other like, the other pants are way cooler because they're like they just look like classic night pants. Like why is this scale and this is plated? Anyways, <laughs> let's do it. Wait, well, before we do that, let's uh, let's uh, reload. Matt, it's pretty good. It's pretty fast reload actually. It's crazy how fast that is. Let's do it. Let's seek victory against this enemy we've fought for millennia at this point. And a lot of y'all hate me for fighting this enemy over and over and over again. Let's see. Boom. Solid damage. This. Boom. Solid damage. This is what makes it crazy. Boom. <laughs> now you might be like, hey, Grin. Why aren't you using that alt damage? I just don't want to waste stuff. It just, like, it's, better. it's not necessary. Like, you just, we just shot him twice. Like, yeah. <laughs> but I'll, sure. Fair enough. Uh, let me shoot some more enemies to build up my all charge. Uh, but we won't use my the other one. We'll use my uh, my TDM one because it's just better. And again, it kind of makes no sense not to use it. <laughs> anyway, because I can just buy this one over again. Now, it, the thing that sucks about TDM weapons is that they're on a cooldown. Um, but yeah, ooh, look at you. The range on this thing is the thing that blows me away. Yeah, I can't believe how good the range is. And I think like you have enough time to actually like lower your your guard. 
yeah, like, I have enough time to run away if that person were to run at me. And even if they were, I think most people who, like, the AI won't run at you. Run! There it is. <laughs> I got my ult. But I think there's one more enemy here. And I ain't having you live. Oh, damn, you made a pathway. Oh, I fucked up! <laughs> I didn't look at you! I didn't look at you! Okay, so that, yeah, the enemies are aggressive, so you need to get a lot more distance. But yeah, that's, again, the fact that it has so much range, you can just run away, and, or, or even better, just jump on a desk, <laughs> and an enemy would be like, well, I guess I'm fucked. <laughs> you just lay into them. So, that's pretty cool. Forgot that was a thing. Yeah, that's weird. On the wiki, it says, uh, 100% piercing. But it says it's blunt damage. Did I misread? No, it's blunt. I'm not crazy. Yeah, pierce is this. Pierce is that. Yeah, it's like a bullet. It's like a laser beam. This is like a, a hammer. Yeah, yeah. Why does it say it's 100% pierce damage? Is it is it because it is 100% pierce damage, even though it says blunt? I don't know. I kind of more... I don't know. I trust the wiki more than I trust the <laughs> fucking die. Maybe, 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 maybe making a mistake. <laughs> don't look at me, please. <laughs> I, don't know what, I don't know what that was. Also, I, I recently purchased both... A pop filter, which I already have a pop filter on my thing, but this one should be better, <laughs> hopefully. And I also bought one of these. It's like a little, it's supposed to be like a better pop filter. <laughs> I, hopefully, it is better. Who knows? Because I hate, I hate like the. P -p -p -p. Also, I would like to be closer to the mic, but I don't want to be that close. Because then, if I breathe, or I go, P -p -p. It, it like smashes your guys' ears, and I don't like that. But also, when I'm far away, the sound quality goes to shit. Especially with an Audio Technica AT2020, you gotta get real, real close to have those actual sounds of your voice. Now, maybe you're like, hey, Grin, we don't want to hear more of whatever that is. And I'm like, all right, well, this is rude. <laughs> That's a lot. I, I don't know why I didn't deserve that, but okay, I'll take it. Also, I ordered some turmeric, because apparently it's good for you. <laughs> I'm that guy, <laughs> apparently. Oh, man. I wish it wasn't a nightmare to make a rage build in this game. Also, I know it's, like, not a viable thing. <laughs> like, I know, like, just to me, the ability to, like, efficiency use, like, efficiently use rage without, like, hindering your damage, like, not your damage, hindering your uh, durability so heavily. Um, or even just, like, again, to be able to build yourself to constantly be able to use these cool abilities. Um, and you can't really do that, or if you if you do, you have to spend a shit ton of death metals or just be really lucky. Um, but, yes, yeah, so let's use our rage move, and I'll show you guys why things get... A little fucking nuts. <laughs> okay. And I don't want to use the the not TDM equivalent because uh, that one someone gave to me. And I feel like I partially have to not break it because it's, you know, it's there. It's not mine. Uh, weird how the brain works. But anyways, let's do this. So it's it's good. It's it's amplified. Can you please lock onto him? But you see how fast it fires? Like boom, 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 boom. It's just insane. So it says like, it gives you knockback. Really? Are you high? <laughs> Look at this. Okay, well, it ended, but that's insane. Yeah, you can even hear because you hear the balls bouncing all over the place. That's crazy because it glitches a little bit, but that's, yeah. Like, again, I don't know why. It's, a, it's one of those ults that you're like, knocks back people. That sounds lame, but like, no, dude, it increases your attack speed. And if you already have um, uh, mastery for it, um, you increase your attack speed with that. So I think that does increase your attack speed overall maybe it just increases your like the like the fire rate up um, of your attack speed let's see I don't think it'll tell you like that but maybe that's how it works but I have no pitcher damage I like this is the weapon I just never used I know it was good it was just one of those weapons that had a lot of leveling to do um, and I just didn't want to put in the effort to level it up because it's a lot um, but yes we got uh, stamina consumption reduced that's also pretty fantastic fire rate increased yeah so that to me would mean it increases the ceiling of your uh, fire rate rather than just the uh, the rate in which you get to max fire rate, you know? Uh, and even if it just increases the rate in which you get it, that would just make it more viable outside of using it as a weird alt weapon. Um, but also, yeah, that's actually, I didn't even notice that. We used our alt and it didn't take that much much out of the weapon. Like, usually when you use an alt, it, like, shreds the weapon, but maybe it's because this weapon is, they, they had to tweak it because it does have a massive fire rate increase, so that would, like, it would just become a weapon that shatters instantly, so maybe they did actually decrease its, its alt a durability hit because it didn't look like it took that much but anyways ladies and gentlemen that was the picture again a weapon that is so so good hopefully well again i don't know if i'm gonna be able to actually pull something off with black thunder maybe uh but also uh, for those guys who are like when's that video coming out grin let it die man it still hasn't changed it's like dogmatic really militant like degree of hey the four spins are here every sunday and that's it or whatever it is i think it's tuesday or wednesday 
they're here uh, and for that day and that's it. And what if I am editing that day or what if anything else happens, you know? Uh, so it's like, oh, uh, so I couldn't do it that day. And then it gets put off for a week. And then, oh, shit, another thing happened. Oh, I'm not really feeling energetic or even like that I want to play this game. I don't want to hate, let it die. So I'm just going to take a break and not not do it today. Oh, wait, now I have to wait another week. So then, yeah. So, like, again, that's also a part of, like, back in the day when I was really, like, in the let it die thing. I'd always make sure I was, like, efficient and doing that thing every week to the best extent that I possibly could. But, yeah, I'm not quite there yet. Also, that looks really cool. Uh, yeah, like, the gold is it's really, really bright. There's almost like a glow stick kind of neon thing. Uh, like, when you're looking at the dark, two, uh, two stand out pretty, or one stands out pretty heavily. Which is weird that it's, go yeah, like, th that's supposed to be blood, right? What's on this one? Looks like, just like oil. <laughs> what a little bit of red there. It's kind of hard to see. But anyways, ladies and gentlemen, let me try to get a thumbnail so we're not just the worst. <laughs> All right. Let's get a little tilt in here. We are a knight wielding a freakish, cartoonish, like, clown uh, gadget. All right. All right. Wouldn't it be cool if you could do do wield? You'd just be like, <laughs> that'd be crazy. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, this was Let It Die. Who knows what kind of videos we'll make along the horizon. Uh, there's still a bunch of stuff that I kind of just want to tidy up and do, so there'll be Let Die content coming up to you guys um, ever so slightly. Again, this is not a game that we mainly cover because there's no content to cover anymore. Uh, but yet there is. There's still content to cover. I still would like to climb to the highest floor possible that I can until I die and do that one time. Um, I would still like to level up this armor to the highest possible points. Uh, and then also I want to do the Forceman stuff, so there's still things to do, but there's nothing like... It, it's just me working for the game and not the game giving me anything in return, you know what I mean? Maybe the weapons for the Forceman could be cool to mess around with, but that's kind of it. Um, but yeah, uh, again, I, I'm, I'm enjoying many other games right now, and I'm, I know you guys are too, and that's fantastic. Uh, again, Genshin to me is a game that I'm just... It's just refreshing to have a game that gives back to you, you know? Like, it constantly... There's an update almost every other week, and it just feels good to have, like, a game that can kind of be your center plate. Also, it's a co-op game, so we can, like, play as a community together, which is just, again, something that I, I'm so happy that there's a game like that, that both has, like, the elements of... Of, uh, of like consistently updating itself but also it has elements of, of community in it um, which I think is just lovely uh, and I know not a lot of you guys are into that whole aesthetic although to me it is it's a kind of a weird looking game too it's like very anime very bright and vibrant but also weird ass characters are in it anyways so I know it may not translate but I appreciate everyone who's been checking out this video as well it means the world um, and yeah thank you so much for your time uh, cannot, I don't know what the next live dive video will probably be probably us leveling up the armor but we'll see anyways ladies and gentlemen thank you for your time and goodbye